What is up lads and welcome back to another episode of X Squads and this time guys it's going to be X Middlesbrough Squad up the borough, up the borough, up the borough. <laughs> yeah, X Middlesbrough Squad guys, well quite a few you know decent players, I'm using a 3 4 one 2 just for the simple fact that I couldn't find any X Middlesbrough left backs in the game. If you know any X Middlesbrough left backs do leave in the comments, I'll be sort of dead interested to sort of find one. I was looking around for ages for about 2 or 3 hours and just could not find a single player so yeah, I actually found one guy but he's now a centre back in Ultimate Team, Frank Quadru. For, he plays for Lens now. He used to also play for Birmingham, but he's now a centre back. So yeah, I uh, suppose that is that. But in goal, guys, we've got Mark Schwartz. Uh, plays for Fulham in the Premier League. Really good Australian goalkeeper. Getting on a little bit now, but you know, a decent goalkeeper. Then in the defence, using three-man defence, uh, right centre back got David Wheater. He left Middlesbrough last season. He joined Bolton. A quite a you know a decent defender. Not the best defender in the world by any stretch of the imagination. You know he's no Stephen Taylor, but you know he's, he's a decent enough defender at that. And the other centre back we've got is Woodgate, who's been in quite a number of these squads. I think he's been in two of the um, previous sort of episodes. Bit of a journeyman currently at Stoke. A bit like his partner there in crime, Robert Hoof, German centre back. Bit of a crazy animal also in form you could pick up but to be honest I really don't like using him I don't know what it is he's just I just kind of play with him he's very slow and he's just not my cup of tea left midfield we've got Stuart Downing one of the Middlesbrough Academy players you know Middlesbrough have got a really good academy and um, well, I say really good they've got Stuart Downing but yeah they produce quite a lot of you know decent English youngsters like Adam Johnson Stuart Downing players like that all came through the Middlesbrough Academy you no, know, some really sort of, I wouldn't exactly say decent players, but you know, just, you know, goodish players. Stuart Downing in the game is actually not that bad. He's got a good delivery on him. And in the midfield, we've got Lee Catamon, who's an absolute wanker. Um, absolute scum of a player. I, should've just, I shouldn't have actually allowed him in the squad. I should have discarded him. I was thinking about making a video of just buying like 200k's worth for him, just discarding every single one, just for the YOLO factor. The other midfielder, guys, is Jonathan Green and plays for Nottingham Forest in the championship. Decent enough sort of championship sort of midfielder. He's actually a defensive midfielder, so of default position in the game but I change up a centre mid just to make sure he gets the nine chemistry and in the centre forward we have got Geordie Shaw celebration and um, the man Danny Graham <laughs> absolute beast of a strike guys really good in my team he's only got two star skills I do believe but he's actually got a really good shot on him good in the air quite a you know well-rounded silver striker he plays for Swansea City obviously and up front we have got uh, Yakubu, absolute monster of a player, currently playing in China. Um, he's, his in-form isn't the greatest, to be perfectly honest. I think the silver cards is better in my opinion, but I got the in-form because it is Yakubu. you got to feed the yak, you know what I mean? you got to get the in-form just out of respect to the, the god that is Yakubu. And the other striker is Leroy Lita, who's also at Swansea like Danny Graham. Um, ex uh, Middlesbrough, obviously ex Middlesbrough, yeah. <laughs> but he's going to be ex Middlesbrough, anyway, that is the squad. But yeah, that is starting 11, guys. It is quite a, you know, it's quite a strong start on 11 you know there's, there's, there's worse I suppose and there is better on the bench your first substitute is Lee Dong Gook who was an absolute disaster at Middlesbrough couldn't you know score to save his life so yeah <laughs> and then we've got a few other players we've got like Ali Ali we've got Tunchai we've got O'Neill we've got Frobitio Russian back who's a Brazil, a Brazil player who actually went to China as well he's currently playing in China I'm not entirely sure what the team is called but yeah he'll not be in FIFA 13 on the team we've got a few, a few more subs on the bench we've got like Jones we've got Young Turn well, just some you know um, young sort of uh, players basically I suppose they're not that young anymore, but they were, they were young when they were at Middlesbrough. And a few players in the reserves that used to play for Middlesbrough. We've got a couple of bronze players that play for Oxford to uh, strikers. We've got Franks. Got you know quite decent pace for English bronze, 74 pace. Looks like you're not a bad player, really. Also got Jason Yule, who's currently applying his trade at AFC Wimbledon in League 2. I'm not entirely sure how he's getting on recently, but he was a decent player in, in his day. You know, he's getting on a little bit now. He's in his late 30s. And we also have another uh, Oxford player in Tom Craddock looks sort of like a decent player as well 71 pace nice little bronze player and I played a two games of this team guys you know and I'll show you the goals that I got with the team they're not the you know the greatest goals you're ever going to see but I just thought I would put them in just to you know just to give you a little bit of sort of gameplay action rather than just having the, just the team on the screen and me talking about the team but if you're going to make this team guys it's quite a fun team I would you know recommend building it if you if you support Middlesbrough of course you'd really enjoy it but if you don't support Middlesbrough if you support say like you know anyone just I really recommend go out and make if you got the coins, go and build the X squad of your sort of favourite team, whoever that may be. It might be Plymouth, it might be Doncaster, it might be Rangers, it might be Dundee United, whoever it is. Just go and build it, guys. It's really good, uh, fun 
I think I do. And I'll leave a link of this website where you can check out previous players from sort of their Brit major British clubs. I'll try and leave that in the description so you can just check out if you want to make your own sort of version of this series. And if you want me to do your club, so, uh, just leave it in the comments, guys, and I will sort of pick one at random, basically. One that's sort of a little bit different and a little bit unusual. A bit like this one, you know, it's not a sort of a common. It wasn't really commonly suggested, but I thought I'd go for it because I've had some decent players. But this is the video coming to a close, guys. If you enjoyed the video, remember to leave a rating. It's always appreciated. And I will be back maybe tonight with the Football Manager video. I was meant to upload one last night, but I completely forgot. I do apologize about that. But I probably will upload one tonight because I'm, I'm start work late tomorrow. So, yeah, guys, I will sign out now. And that was quite a fluky goal by Lita. And peace.